Hello, everybody. I am Dr. Sarah Wooten, and I am so pleased that you're back to see one of my, another one of my videos. Yay! Thank you so much. Uh, these videos are all about cats. In these videos, we talk about cat health, cat behavior, cat care, all things cat. So in this video, we are going to be talking about five signs that your cat trusts you. Okay, I would say the top signs that your cat trusts you are vocalizations and body language. So just like us, our cats use both body language and vocalization to tell us how they feel. And so the things that your cat will be doing if they trust you and per, perhaps like you are things like butting you with their head. That's called or rubbing you with their low whiskers. That's called bunting. And actually what they're doing when they do that is they have little scent glands right here. Uh, their sense that humans can't smell, but other cats can smell. And they're rubbing those little scents all over you to tell everybody else, this human belongs to me. They also do it when they rub other parts of their body on you. They also have scent glands located at the base of their tail. So oftentimes a cat will come up to you and then kind of whoop with their butt on you. That's them telling you that they like you and they trust you other signs. If they sit in your lap and they purr, that's a good sign that they really trust you because they're very calm and relaxed. Also cats um, that are purring and kneading or making biscuits, great sign that your cat is at peace and feels full of trust towards you. A couple of other things. If they walk towards you and they have their tails straight up and even if they have like a little crook to one side or the other, those are signs that your cat really likes you and trusts you. A couple of other signs, if you're uh, looking at your cat and you do a slow blink like that, and your cat does a slow blink back, that's a sign of love and trust. Good job, cat parent. And then the last thing is when you come into a room or you come home or something like that and they run into the room and they're all excited to see you and they're meow, meow, meow. That's a sign that they trust you. And that's also a sign that they like you. It's also a sign that they consider you to be the guardian of all good things, especially food. So that is the number one sign, the vocalizations and body language. The number two sign that a cat trusts you is a cat that will roll over and show you their tummy. Man, that is a huge sign of trust. So in the wild, cats uh, are both predator to smaller animals and prey to larger animals. And so prey animals have to always be on the lookout, right? They always have to be looking around. They always need to feel safe and they need to protect their vital organs. And a cat's vital organs are in their, you guessed it, in their belly and in their chest. So a cat that rolls over on his back and shows you their, their tummy, that cat feels very confident and very, very trusting of you. Just because they're showing you their belly, however, doesn't give you an open invitation to touch it. I consider the belly a no-go zone, a no-no zone for most cats because they just, most of them don't tend to like it. It tends to make them feel a little, oh, a little tense. And other cats who may be really aggressive cats that like to play aggressively, they'll use that as an open invitation to rabbit kick your hand with their back legs grab your hand with their front claws and even bite on your hand. So those are all signs that, you know, maybe the cat wants to play, but maybe the cat's just saying, hey, I am showing you I trust you. Please don't take this too far. You need my consent to go to that space. So the number two sign is a cat that shows you their tummy is a cat that trusts you. The number three sign uh, that I think that shows that a cat is trusting of you is they let you groom them. So again, cats are fastidious groomers that usually take care of their body on themselves by licking and grooming. But some cats need a little extra help. Maybe you've got some long hair, maybe you've got some shedding, maybe you've got some arthritis that makes it so they can't turn around quite as well, or there's lots of different reasons. And so 
a cat that lets you brush them is a cat that shows you that they trust you. So again, a lot of parts of the cat, they don't necessarily like you to touch them, but sometimes you got to when you're grooming, especially if you got to get a mat out or something. And if that cat stays relaxed and lets you complete your task, that is a sign of trust in you. All right, the number four sign that I think shows that a cat has a lot of trust in you, human, is that they let you pick them up. And let me put a little caveats in this. They let you pick them up and they feel relaxed when you pick them up. I used to call these the no bones cats. When you pick them up and you're like this and they're just like, right? And they're just kind of going with whatever. Some people will take the cat and, you know, kind of even hold it like a baby and the cat's just laying there like this. That cat is in full trust and in full confidence. Now, if you pick a cat up and the cat goes tense or the cat has puffed out hair or the claws come out and they, they do this thing or they're, they're trying to get away from you, that cat does not have any trust. And you're gonna have to go back on to the drawing board, start again from the beginning with building trust with that cat. So my number four sign is that it, the cat lets you pick them up and they stay nice and relaxed through the entire experience. The number five sign that a cat trusts you and loves you and thinks that you are the center of their universe is they bring you presents. So cats are hunters, right? We know that they're hunters. And so if you wake up one morning and you go out on your doorstep and you see a half chewed mouse or bird wing or a piece of a lizard or something and think, oh, gross, what is this? That is a gift from your cat to you, showing that they have confidence and love and they honor you and they feel honored by you. So the number five sign that a cat trusts you is that they bring you presents. So that's all I have. I have those five signs. And if you go through those signs and you're like, check, 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 check. Well, good job. You have created an amazing human animal bond with your cat. If you're going through the signs and you see some areas for improvement, that's an opportunity to continue to build trust and confidence in your cat and deepen that relationship between the two of you. You can check out our other videos that we have on YouTube on ways to build trust or ways to help a cat let you love them more. Um, and then if you have any other signs that you think about, we'll go ahead and put them down in the comment section. You can also uh, leave me comments about what you think about the video or topics that you would like me to cover things like that. Thank you so much for watching. I am Dr. Sarah Wooten. This is all about cats and I will see you again soon for another video.